Hello! Welcome! This is Math Classroom where we take you through basic mathematics. This is for basic four, class four. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and kindly click on the bell to receive notifications anytime we upload a new video for basic four. Thank you. So we want to look at numbers. We are talking about numbers today, the number system, the gates and all that. And we want to look at the place value of numbers. If you have a number, what is the place of that number? What is the value of the number as well? And we'd like to use the number wheel. The number word wheel. Okay. So for place value charts, if we are talking about the place value charts, then we are looking at something. So let me write the place value charts okay so we have the ones we have tens we have hundred then we have thousands then we have ten thousand then we have hundred thousand okay so this is the place value chart so that anytime I give you a number you could write you can place in a place value chart which makes it easier to call out the number no matter how big or how huge that number is even up to seven decades number system so we have the ones like i just wrote so to write it out nicely we are going to take our time so don't worry we have ones we have t for tens then h for hundred then thousand th which is thousands then t th which is ten thousand ten thousands then hundred th which is what hundred hundred thousands this is what our place value was charts that could help us to know the place of a digit in a number and the value of a particular digit as well in a number so if i use the wheel let's say the wheel has This is ones, tens, hundred, thousands, ten thousands. Then I have hundred thousand hundred thousand the next is what the millions the next is what the millions so let's say this is my wheel i could use the wheel if i have a ring in them so this is the wheel which looks like a ring if i have some points in them i could use the points and the wheel to determine the number I have. So let's say I have, I hope I can clean this part. Let's 
let's say for my ones, let's say I have two pair bowls here. I have like three. I have one. I have one, two, three, five. Okay, very good. So with something like this, I can look at it. I can ask you how many pebbles. Let's what I have in here are pebbles. How many pebbles landed in the ones column? So then let's go to the ones column. How many pebbles do we have here? We have what two pebbles. How many pebbles landed in there? Thousand columns. So where are we? This is a thousand column. How many pebbles do you have? They have one, two, three, four, five. So five pebbles landed in the thousand column. So if five pebbles landed there, then I have like five times what? Thousand, which is what? Five words thousand. So this is what you have for that. Then how about the 10,000? How many pebbles do you have there? Two. So the value there, the decades there is two. If I want the value, the place value there, it is what? Two times what? 10,000, which is equal to what? 20 words, 1,000. So we can do this on and on. On and on. So if I'm able to do this, I'll be able to represent what the number. So something like this. Okay, let's write, let's try writing that number out. You realize that you have let me write it here. Let's have hundred thousand ten thousand thousand. I have words again, hundred, tens, and words, once. If I want to write the number, the value for this, what am I getting? I have words, one, two, three, so three, ten thousand is words, two, thousand is words, one, two, three, four, five, five, then hundred is words, one tens is what one two three three then once is what two so this is the number i have okay so let's take another example we still have our wheel we want to use a wheel to on the place value charts so we are going to count Count a pebble. So let me put a pebble here. Let's say one. So what do I want to do? I want to count the pebbles in each of the ring and represent the number on the place words value charts. So this is my place value charts. I have one, cents, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, and words, hundred words, thousand. So let's do that on the place value chart. So let's look at once. Oh, where do you want us to start from? Once or the hundred thousand? Okay, so let's look at the ones. How many pebbles do I have in once? I have words, one. How about the tens? I have one, two, and three. So I have three. Then, how many do I have in the hundred? So this is hundred. One and two. Then for thousand, how many are you counting? I'm counting two. This and that, which is what? Two. Then for ten thousand, what do I have? Ten thousand is also counting two. Wow, one and two. Then, Hundred thousand, let's count. One, I have two, three, four, and five. 
so I have been able to represent what the pebbles in the ring on what my place was value was charts the same way if should I give you a place value chart and I ask you to represent it on a wheel you should be able to do a similar thing so let's look at let's say I give you this so I have my hundred thousand thing thousand thousand hundred tens and words once okay so this is what I have so now I'm giving you the place value charts then you do it on the wheel at home so Okay, so let's say I have six zero three one two four. Okay, so this is what we have. So this is a first example. So let's go to our wheel. The hundred thousand column has what? Six pebbles. So let's go six, one, two, three, four, five, six. The 10,000 has words zero, so it has words no pebbles. So let's go to the thousand column. How many there? We have three. So this is thousand. One, two, three. Then to the hundred, one. Tens is words two. Then once is words four. Very good. Should we try again? Let's try again. Let's try, let's try. Let me write two, two. This is example two, okay. Two, one, four, five, three, two. Okay, so let's look at the wheel. Let me clean the initial one. Okay, and see your peel in ye. This is your place value charting. And see, I should share no our peel name. It's all for once now, two. And see, I should share it. And can you one, two? Then see, I ain't three. And see, I can't three. One, two, three. Hundred column, they are here. Five. Okay. Go one, two, three, four, five. And that's a thousand is what? Four. One, two, three, four. Very good. We are all doing well. Then 10,000. How many? One. And that's of 100,000 is what? Two. One, two. Very good. So we are all doing well. So basically, this is how it works and if you know this then we can be able to what, expand the numbers that will be our next topic for our next lesson until then study hard and take care of yourself don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell bye